Give music and empowerment was a message one teacher spread not only across the borderland, but the entire state, even after her tragic death. KTSM 9 News reporter Cesar Vasquez shows us her legacy and how it will soon be honored in the Sun City. Among many things, Esme Barrera was a special needs teacher, an impactful musician, and now her family and friends are working to create a path of empowerment for younger women in the borderland. You know, this idea of my ideas are important and I can make an impact in my community and my school. Esmeralda Barrera's message now on its way to the borderland. In 2012, Esme was murdered at her home while attending college in Austin. To honor her, family and friends are beginning to create a local girls' rock camp aimed at providing a path for young women to find hidden talents. It focuses on folks that don't usually have access to that kind of thing. Music is a really expensive hobby to get into. Showing them the meaning of being empowered. So we see kids that start, um, start off really shy and then end up you know, running for student council or um, you know, making changes in their neighborhood. The camp Esme participated in helped her create a lasting impact on the music community. She really found her footing there and she excelled and she loved it and one week out of the summer she gave her all to these girls. They hope opening the camp sprouts the next generation of local talent to have an influence like the one Esme still brings with her legacy. So I'd like to imagine that somewhere out there there's I guess a little Esme persona that would really benefit for having something like this there. Um, I think there's a lot of kids out there that are looking for something like this and I just hope that we're providing that space. The Girls Rock Camp plans to be open this summer. If you would like to donate to this cause, we're putting a link on our website, ktsm.com. Live in the studio, Cesar Vasquez, KTSM 9 News. Cesar, thank you.